phase two is going pretty well. Uh, everybody's starting to get into their groove. We are, uh, you know, get district people are getting those, uh, the, the curriculum out to folks, special education's getting their eyes on it, putting their individualization, individualization into it. And I'll let Kimberly talk about that in a minute. And our teachers are, um, are using it to develop those, those daily lessons and, uh, and activities and exercises and assignments for our students to do. So, um, so yeah, I feel like people are starting to get into the routine. We're identifying, working to identify any hiccups with, with connectivity for families and things and working our way through those. And uh, the learning's happening in LISD, Corey. Thank you for asking. So let's talk to Kimberly and Krista a little bit about it. So Kimberly, we get a lot, we've gotten a lot of questions and we know we have a lot of viewers and, and parents out there of students who receive special programs. Um, do you wanna talk about what that has looked like on, on phase two and what you wanna share with our parents and viewers at home? Yes, I would love to. Um, every day, uh, our coordinators and our teachers are sharing amazing examples of the ways that they are meeting our students' needs um, we are continuing to send out lesson plans um, every single Monday for every single student based on their individualized IEP. Um, some of our teachers are going above and beyond and even sending those out on Friday the week before so families can prepare for Monday. We recognize that this is new for our families and new for our students, so we are um, extending grace and relying on our parents to give us some feedback so that we can support our students along the way. Um, so those lesson plans will continue. We're continuing to collaborate with general ed. Um, we are working with related services as well. Um, this is all looking very different. Um, we are providing direct services for some via Zoom. Um, we are providing some activities that are asynchronous opportunities for students along the way as well to continue their learning. Um, we are continuing our support with our parent group. Um, you know, we have parent conferences and support groups that happen throughout the year. Um, we know that we love that and we know that our families do as well and rely on that support from each other. So we're continuing that work um, with our parent group and actually next Tuesday there's an autism support group. Um, and lastly, we are working on reporting out student progress and what those progress reports will look like um, as we're navigating this new phase two. So things are going really well. Um, our teachers are rocking it. Um, they are thrilled to see their students and work with their students. Um, we truly miss them all. So have to give a shout out to our coordinators and our teachers and our instructional assistants as they are doing amazing work to support students and families during this phase two learning. 